All right, guys. Welcome back to another vlog. Just finished our second game on our US tour, and you would have seen hopefully the match on my main channel did end in defeat, a rare defeat. I think I'm right in saying it's our first defeat in 10 games, maybe even more than that. Um, very good team we come up against today, Atlanta United staff team. They, I think they use a squad of about 22 players. They were fresh. I think some of those boys, a lot of those boys, were academy players. And Carlos Bocanegra in there. Yeah, this guy played 100 games, I think, for the US national team. So there's no shame in losing to them. Obviously, we're gutted because we wanted to try and come to America and not get beat. But that's, that's done now. The mission is about not losing again. So in this vlog, you're going to see us starting now all the way through to our third game where we'll end just before kickoff. Uh, the third game's going to be in New York as well. So we've got the rest of today in Atlanta, uh, early flight tomorrow over to New York. And our next game is against another staff team, the New York City staff team, which is going to be equally challenging. They've got great options, obviously, in their academy and some big boys over there. So it's going to be another tough one. And the, the real, real bad news, it's probably worse than the fact that we lost, is that we've picked up some more injuries. I think, I mean, Dan Brown, Rob Easton and Rich Beck are done now. They're going back to England now anyway. They're only here for the Atlanta part. We have got John Dawson meeting us in New York. What extra player. But we may be without Ryan Adams the rest of the tour. That means no Dan Brown or Ryan Adams. And people have been saying for a while we're very reliant on those two up front. We have to have an opportunity to prove that we're not now. Some other lads are going to have to step up because no Rich Beck, no Dan Brown and maybe no Ryan Adams is going to be difficult. Let's go. Richie boy, how are you feeling? That was your last game, wasn't it? Yeah, pretty upset to be honest. Went out injured, obviously a defeat. But it wasn't exactly impressive my own performance, but learn from it, come back stronger, and hope the boys can smash it up in New York. One, two, three! And one more. Right, we're back at the hotel. Quick turnaround. Uh, and then we're going to be going to what well, we're going to Coca Cola HQ, aren't we? Coca Cola HQ for the archive tour. This archive tour is supposed to be next level. I've heard big things. We're going to see some top secret stuff. Not open to the public, VIPs only, so we're very lucky to be getting yeah. in today. The, the tour we had in the last vlog was cool, like museum and stuff, amazing. This is like next level, so we'll see what happens there. It's all about recovery now. We've just got to get things turned around from New York. People are doing ice baths. Me and Seb will have an ice bath later, probably when we get home. But um, yeah, I need a better result next game. There it is, holidays are coming. Here we are at the Coca-Cola headquarters in Atlanta. This is it. And there's a man on a Segway, right on cue. Here we are in the very impressive lobby of Coca-Cola HQ. America? UK? Mm, not sure, Coca-Cola. And Coke Zero, all got their own flags. It's a decent little facility. We had to go through security just now, like at an airport, because it's like Fort Knox. We're in. We made it through. We hacked the mainframe. We're hashtagging it. <laughs> right, the boys have arrived. We're going to the archives. I don't think Jacko's really allowed in archives. That's not really the sort of thing you should be allowed in, really, is it? You're going to burn the place down, probably. I'm not in here under my own name. No, okay. You, <laughs> Just got me Frank Frankerson. Okay. I'm here with Frank Frankerson and the rest of the boys. We're going to the archives. This is going to be interesting. Nickel until 1958, 1948. There we go. When it went up to six cents. Oh, ten cents? It goes in here, right? Yeah. Pull the door. Wow. Pull the heart. Good system. <laughs> That's really cool. You open it. Yeah, I always tell the millennials what that is. That's a bottle opener. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely stuff. Mm -hmm. Anybody else for one? Yeah, no, thank you. Drink it in. It's the archives. It's like a massive library of Coca-Cola. Look at all this stuff. Hello, what's this coming up here? Oh, okay, got all different cups. Look at all those cups. It's like a supermarket. Wow. In World War II, in the 40s, we actually attempted a prototype cam. It looks like an oil can. This never went to market and we ne never did this because during the war we couldn't get metal. So they put this idea to the side, shelved it until 1960 when they came out with that can. All the different oh, World Cup see. footballs, this is what I'm talking Ooh. about. Mini gold balls. Mini gold balls. Look at all they this. They at one of the uh, FIFA's wow, that the local people would make FIFA. soccer balls and crafts and things. Yeah. I've got one of them at home. 
Right guys, it's the morning of a new day. Today's the day we travel to New York. It's super early. It is like, what time is it? 4.30. Like 4.40 a.m. Oh, knackered. Gotta go to the airport like in 10 minutes. And then we go to New York. Let's go. Ready to go to New York, boys? Yeah. <laughs> you don't look very ready. What? <laughs> Early doors. Catching the worms. Man's dog loves worms. Yum, 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 yum. Still dark outside. Ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of your pilots and your Philadelphia based flight attendants, it is our pleasure to welcome you to New York's LaGuardia Airport. Current local time is 8.50. We arrived in New York, but there's a lot of snow on the ground. It's going to be colder. Could be challenging these matches if they even go ahead, to be honest. There's snow on the pitches. What's the rule? I don't know. 3G. I'm going to find out. That was a hard flight. How are you feeling with the smart water? You feel smarter? Much smarter. Charlie, how are you feeling? Tired, oh, man. Do you want to see the swelling on my leg? Oh, God. Look at the state of that. Oh, wow. Can you see it? See it? It looks like a town mine. No, don't. Oh. How are you feeling about your right hand man? You're my right hand man. Oh, on. that's like, yeah. You're just saying that. Yeah, just saying that. yeah no, I appreciate it. Then. We are now in the Uber, on the way to the hotel, and I think this is a quite different compared to the uh, Uber journey that we had to the Atlanta hotel when we arrived, because it's early morning, we're all shattered, there's no music playing. And, um, but no, I mean, I'm excited, I'm pretty sure, Charlie and Sam are excited because it's, it's, their first, it's your first time here, isn't it? It is, yeah. 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 First time for me, mate. Uh, looking forward to it. Um, Shopping, I heard it's like a movie, so it is yeah. like the movies. Is it your first time spending? I heard it's your first time as well. First it? time, mate. Yeah, oh, okay. Miscommunication. What about you, right? Uh, first time in New York, but I've obviously been to Vegas and Atlanta, so getting about wow. right now. Getting about, mate. But yeah, let's do it. So close, you can almost taste it. Release your inhibitions, feel the rain on your skin. No party, no party. <laughs> Right, we've checked into our hotel in New York and a um, little bit of a spoiler alert, Alex doesn't travel very light. She brings a lot of stuff around with her. She's very high maintenance. Let me show you how much stuff she's bought. Dum, 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 do, 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 do. Look at all this stuff. It's all Alex's makeup. Dad, um, a girl needs options. <laughs> in all seriousness, the other rooms weren't ready yet, so everyone's put their stuff in here. And it's not even everyone's bags yet. Still a few more boys to arrive, but this is our room. We're at capacity. And we're all going to be sleeping on this bed tonight. 22 of us, I think. Cozy? Oh, yeah, Spencer and Alex's. Cozy. So like it. Team bonding. Team building. Team bonding. This is the view from our room. New York, Manhattan Island is right outside. That's where we're playing tomorrow. Well, the staff team, anyway. New York City FC. Turkey club for me. Lovely. Apparently they've got a bit of a rat problem in New York. Asbestos kills. Guys, we're here at the eSports and Gaming Studio here at the flagship Microsoft store in New York. Yeah, we've got a load of the guys here. What are you playing, Rocket League? Rocket League, yeah. All the hashtag boys are loving it. Four and four, we've got Ryan, we've got Glenn, star cameraman. Ash, cameraman, also a star. Saundy Dondy, we know about him. Louis Preston, Charlie Morley, Sam Adams, and Mr. Producer Adam Boltwood. Yes. Playing a little bit of Rocket League. We may be coming back here in a few days for a big FIFA tournament. We've also got Hashtag Harry and Hashtag Mike joining us here in New York. Which obviously they're going to want to get involved. We've got our umpire here, Stevie CB. You seen some good Rocket League? 
Yeah, it's pretty decent. Yeah? You're quite good at Rocket League, aren't you? Smashed it. Completed it, mate. I could get my seat over here, yeah, it's too easy. Completed it, mate. We've got some uh, viewers here in the gallery. <laughs> Guest hashtag, uh, spectator, Greg. How you doing, Greg? Hi guys, how you doing? Face of Manage Dog Manager. Well, I don't come to the theatre, I want to come to Rocket League, so uh, it's a culture. Have you played Rocket League? Never played it. No. <laughs> but I reckon you like it. TJ, have you played Rocket League? Uh, not for me, no. Not for me, Clive. Not for me, Clive. <laughs> <laughs> this is quite cool, look. Got these little face cams and people play. Somebody's loving it. Yeah. There it is. Look of concentration on your face. This game, I used, uh, I think it was last summer, I was playing this pretty much every day, so it's clearly why we're winning. Oh, Alex. <laughs> See ya. Mate, I bloom person, we should be, look. Woohoo, pretzels. And coca -Cola. That part of the lake is still completely frozen over. It's probably about 10 degrees right now, but it's just not. It shows you how cold it was last week. It's just rock solid, it's slowly melting. Beautiful park. Me and Alex came here last year. You can check the video out on our channel if you're interested. Highly recommended. Alphabet dating, horse riding in Central Park. That is a serious milkshake for Stevie CB. Don't like it? Uh, Man's dog. What milkshake you got? I play uh, Oreo. Medically, Oreo. Steve, medically speaking, is it <laughs> pretty much. Right. If you have to have a milkshake, I've got peanut butter myself and some chicken wings. Right, here we are in our hotel room now without everyone's suitcases in here. We've cleared them out, so we've settled in. I think everyone's a bit tired at the moment. We had an early flight, so some people are having naps. Some people are getting some treatment with Stevie CB, which is essential for survival with what will be our third game in six days tomorrow. And shout out to Coca-Cola, they have literally delivered again. We've got loads of Coca-Colas waiting for us here in our rooms, which is fantastic. And perhaps even more importantly, we've got a load of these smart waters, uh, which will keep us hydrated, obviously, for the football as well. So we've got water, like massive smart waters actually, they're really handy. Fair play. The reinforcements have arrived. John Dawson is in the building and we need him because people are dropping like flies injury wise. John Dawson's going to be crucial in tomorrow's big game. Scorer of the goal of the season in 2016. Can he bang one in American soil? I hope so. It's night time in New York. The hashtag squad are out in full force. Going to get some food. And, uh, but we need early nights really, don't we, Stevie? If we're going to hit the ground running tomorrow, we need early nights for the squad? Yeah, definitely early night and I'm going to be doing a uh, wee inspection in the morning. I want to see clear, odourless wee wee. What? So plenty of water tonight. No uh, More reinforcements. Hashtag Harry is in the building. Yes, Harry. Big. He's not just a FIFA player. He's going to be showing us his football skills as well. <laughs> Pulled pork. <laughs> <laughs> Bright lights, big city. How many light bulbs are there in Times Square? Twelve. Twelve. I'd say <laughs> thousand. At least twenty. At least twenty. We'll never know. We'll never the answer. Like Coca Cola, tomorrow we'll be back refreshed after our last defeat. We're gonna get a big trip. First game in New York City, Manj Dog Manja, you pumped. Getting in the zone, mate. Mentally prepared for this, we need to bounce back with a win. Phil Martin, you ready? I'm, I'm raging still from the other day, so I could not be any more ready for this game. Time for justice, come on. We do not want two losses on the bounce. That's not how we do things at hashtag. Harry's here, hashtag Harry, of course. Two weeks. He's a born winner. Wins on FIFA, are you going to win in real life today, Harry? Yeah. Okay, I love the confidence. <laughs> Short but sweet, he's a man of few words. Any questions? Let's go.
we have arrived. Look at this backdrop. Bridges everywhere. This is the pitch we're playing on. Got more reinforcements that have arrived in the shape of this man, who we're gonna be playing against in a few days, but for today, he's making his second appearance in a hashtag shirt, and his name <laughs> is Jimmy Conrad. What's up? Yes, Jimmy. Thanks Welcome back. You. Thank you. Buzzing to make your second appearance for I hashtag? I am buzzing. I've this got a top uh, for you, mate. Do you? I've got, I've got a top one. for you. Which even, color? Which, which color? Blue. It's even, got, it's even got your name on the back. No way. I'll show you. What do you think of the pitch? Have a look, mate. Look for yourself. Oh, oh my gosh. That's probably got to be one of the best backdrops yeah. I've ever seen. How are you feeling though? Are you feeling ready for this or? I feel old, but the cold doesn't help. No, cold doesn't help. The wind, cold, it yeah. It takes me longer to grease my wheels when I'm older. <laughs> I think you'll be perfectly fine. We'll see. We'll, we'll see. see. I'm, I'm disappointed I don't see Patrick Vieira over there. I just yeah. think he's scared. <laughs> Bit warm, isn't it? It's, it's freezing. It is freezing. Absolutely freezing. But um, all we need to think about is what an experience to play. It's, it's an amazing setting. This. The setting is unbelievable. Yeah. The pitch, not so unbelievable. Or unbelievable for different reasons to the backdrop. Yeah. Um, yeah no, it's, uh, it looks alright. It's flat. It just, it's not the, the usual quality we have been playing on, especially it's after right. um, after Monday's game. Yeah. And then that, uh, but yeah, it's amazing. I mean. Look at that, it's just ridiculous. I mean, I, I, th I don't think this video is going to do it any justice.